everybody it is your girl sincerely drink and i'm back today with another video As y'all can see from the side down below, you already know what it is. You already know what's popping, you already know what time of year it is. It is the first day of school. I'm not gonna cap, it is afternoon. Like, it's a little bit afternoon, for real, for real. I started my first class at nine in the morning today, but I was up from like 7.30ish because, oh shoot, sorry. <laughs> there was like a, um, a bug that just tried to attack me in my face. But, um, I was up since like 7.30ish because some of the other RAs in my building were doing a little program. They were giving out Chipotle biscuits. So you know, I was like, mm, I could wake up and get one of them for free instead of making breakfast. So that's what I did this morning and I got dressed. I'm not sure if I showed y'all the fit just yet, but I shall see y'all later because I did do some recording. And then y'all, so I went to my first class, blah, blah, blah. After my first class, I took a first day of school picture because University Union is, um, Sorry, I thought somebody was by me. But University Union is doing this thing this year where they're doing first day school pictures and they're giving people pictures. So I went over there and I took me a little picture or whatever. But y'all, after that, that's this is why this vlog is starting till now. My phone didn't want to work. They wanted to act stupid. Like my phone was black in the sense where like, so I have a fingerprint scanner and I could feel the vibrations and all of that on the phone, but nothing was turned on like the screen was just dead black so i didn't know what to do because like y'all sorry that classes to be completely honest school is not paid for and definitely everything is paid it's supposed to be paid today so i'm over here freaking out like dang that's a call the financial aid office i'm gonna call the financial aid office with no phone but um i don't really know what exactly i did but it's working out for sure some updates the buses y'all Baby, baby, baby. The buses feel like I'm back to freshman year. The buses are packed. People are standing up on buses, like packed like some sardines, and I don't like it. I do not like it, because I like my personal space. Especially because Rona is still going on. I see my mask. I've been wearing my mask inside, and when I'm around other people, but clearly I'm outside and not around nobody. But, yeah. It's been, it's definitely crazy for sure. I can say from the black student perspective, because I know somebody asked about that under one, under one of my other videos and I couldn't get to it just yet. Definitely one of the only black people in my class so far. But I'm headed to my third and last class for the day. I'm pretty early. I have like space in between all my classes. So probably just gonna chill, look at my syllabus, make sure I have everything together because I don't know if I told y'all, but I do plan on dropping a class at some point. But I'm not sure which one I want to drop. So, I'm not buying nothing just yet. I'm waiting to see what I want. And then, I'm going to figure out from there. But y'all, yeah, I'm going to head to this class. Stop talking your ears off because it's been three minutes already. But, I will talk to y'all. After this class, I might go and try to see some people. You know, I'm trying to be more social this year, so... That's probably what I'll do. And I'll talk to y'all then. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. You wanna know why? Cause I'm a big dumb dumb. No, like for real. I just walked all the way over here. If you're familiar with UGA area, I walked all the way to Studio 225 cause that's where I thought my class was. Cause that's usually where this class is. Check the thing cause I'm like, hey, ain't nobody here. Class starts in, how long? Um, class starts in like three minutes. And I'm like, okay, so it's not like that early or is it like it's just like that late? No, I got dropped off on the bus right in front of the building that I needed to be in. So now I'm gonna be late because I decided to walk all the way over here instead of going to my class. Ricky mistake. <laughs> but yeah, just had to update y'all on how my day is going. Just been taking L after L, that's two L's for the day. Let's not get a third one. Let's make the day turn around and be better from here. But yeah, I'm on my way to the right location for my last class for the day. And I'll see y'all later. 
so hey y'all hey y'all i'm finally back to the room um i think last time i talked to y'all it was after my class let me actually put y'all down because baby a whole lot a whole lot of what's going on today i think i already told you about my phone not working i'm not sure if i did or not but yeah my phone wasn't working at some point in time today so that was my first l then y'all saw my second l where i went to the wrong class that's just a whole lot a whole lot of but then after that, the reason why I didn't, I don't think I talked to y'all again after that was because when I came back to the room, I got on the phone with my sister. And we were basically talking for a hot second and I took a nap. <laughs> but um, I was supposed to be having a org or a e-board meeting with the Caribbean Student Association, but they were sophomore welcome today, so we got to push that back. And then after that, I went to an event in Rooker Hall that was done by the CAs. And if you're not, if you're not at UJ and you don't know what a CA is, the CA is what we call a class advocate. It's for continuing the legacy of African-American success, I believe. But basically, or continuing the legacy of African-American students. Something like that. But um, they're basically people that are put in the community in order to ensure that our minority students do feel included in our community and have the support that they need because it can be, it's probably some of their first time being at a PWI and things like that. So they're just there to provide resources and help for those students along with including everybody else into learning about diversity that we have, about the diversity that we have in the halls. So I went to that event and that was pretty cool. I really don't know why I didn't record while I was there, but it was pretty cool. We got to see a lot of um, our black UGA students between all the different years. People were giving advice, help, all sorts of things like that. And then we did like a uh, this or that sort of thing. So we talked about some hot topics. Ooh. And then we did this thing that's called, I don't even know if there's like an actual name for it, but if you are familiar with this or not, there's this channel called Jubilee on YouTube. And they do this thing called Spectrum where they have things from strongly disagree, disagree, neutral, strong agree, agree. You know what I'm trying to say. But um, we did things like that. And we talked about other hot topics, which I thought was cool too. And then we worked on connecting some of the freshmen and our second years, because you know they didn't really have a they didn't have a usual year last year, but just connecting them to some of the resources and some of the resources that we have on campus, along with upperclassmen who are in their same field, so that they have someone of their color that they can look up to. So I thought that was pretty cool. I was supposed to have dance practice today. We were supposed to be coming up with choreography for a workshop that i'm actually going to be teaching on friday but it was just a whole lot a whole lot of the people that were coming they were both sophomores we had sophomore welcome today and i wanted them to experience sophomore welcome because of course they could not experience freshman welcome the way that i was able to experience my year so i allowed them to do that and they went to go get dinner and then by that point i'm like okay it's gonna be a little too late we do still have classes in the morning tomorrow too so we're just gonna meet back up tomorrow for that so y'all will definitely see a little bit of that. Of course, it's gonna be some copyrighted stuff, but I'm gonna see if I can show y'all just a little some, a little some, some. Um, but yeah, now I'm back at the room. And since I'm at the room and I'm not practicing tonight, I am going to, I think I'm actually going to come up with some of that dance, choreograph some of that dance, just so that if we do run over on time tomorrow, I know I at least have an idea. I have. I have a vision of what I want to see for this dance. I already know the song, all that stuff, but it's not like fully choreographed step by step. So I'm probably gonna work on some of that. So even if they don't have ideas tomorrow, I can at least show them what I'm thinking of. And if they had any comments to chime in on, then we could do that then. But yeah, I'm gonna get to the room and work on that. And that's probably about it for the night. I'm not making no dinner tonight or anything like that. I'll probably make dinner tomorrow. So y'all would definitely see some of that for sure. But yeah, y'all, first day of school, we took a couple L's. We took a couple L's for show today, but we're back in action and tomorrow should be a good one. I have two classes tomorrow, but we'll get into all that when I see y'all tomorrow. But it's been a good day. I hope y'all had a good first day as well. And we gonna see y'all for the second day of the first day of classes tomorrow. All passengers must wear a mask on the bus. Good morning, y'all. Good morning, y'all. It is officially the second day of the first day of classes. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. But um, I just got back. Kind of see Joe Frank by me. Um, I just got back from my first class of the day. 
and I have a whole lot of time until my second class. So I'm gonna head back to the room because I did not eat breakfast this morning and I'm kinda hungry. So I'm gonna go over there and make some eggs and I'll probably make a smoothie too because I haven't been on my smoothie stuff in a hot second. Um, and I'm probably gonna take a nap to be completely honest because y'all, I was fighting my sleep so bad in this class and my sleep was winning. But like, yeah, so I'm gonna take a nap and then Depending on what time I wake up from that nap, I may start making my door decks for some of the other RAs, but I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, the day is already starting and popping. We off to a okay, good start, you know, but there's only one more class for the day and then we're done and then we get into the fun stuff of the night. But yeah, I'll see y'all whenever I do the next thing. <laughs> hey y'all, hey y'all, so I'm back in the room. Um, it is after midnight. I showed y'all me at practice and literally ever since then I came in my room and I was talking to my mom for a hot second, just updating her about how the first day of school and stuff or the second first day of school went. But since then, that was probably after like seven or eight, I've literally just been sitting here on my laptop applying for this internship that my one of my fashion merchandising teachers told us about in class yesterday and I'm really interested in it because this is something that I want to do post graduation and I feel like it's a really good opportunity for me to get some really good experience and I'm really excited about this like if anybody knows me I'm a last minute person with applications but like the way I just been jumping all this and trying to get it done updating my resume because that hasn't been updated I've had a couple jobs since the last one or just like updating positions and like that so like i've just been jumping on all that i made the cover letter tonight all that sort of stuff so i just need to get all that reviewed real quick and i'm sending that off first thing in the morning because maybe i i'm really excited about this like it sort of combines fashion merchandising and what i want to do so i'm really excited like if i really get this opportunity it's gonna be really big for me um but yeah i did that and yeah that's all i've been doing i've been sitting in the same exact position since then but stay tuned for tomorrow um the outfit today i didn't show y'all the outfit today let me show y'all <laughs> y'all gotta remind me these things come on now so here's the outfit don't look at this you know this was on earlier but this is the shirt um it just says ceo this shirt is actually black business i shop black female owned business um and i would tell y'all the information for it but unfortunately i don't think she does this work anymore so i i don't think it makes sense to tell y'all um and i actually work with some blue jeans these ones sitting right here just some white blue jeans um similar to the jeans that i wore yesterday but there's no holes in this one and i wore my bands again and then I just wore like a gold chain sort of situation. But tomorrow, y'all, because I don't know if I said this yesterday, but tomorrow, y'all, because I will show y'all again tomorrow, the first day of classes. Um, the whole fit will be from Shein, except the shoes. I'm not wearing Shein shoes. But the whole fit will be from Shein. I may wear Shein shoes, actually. I'm going to think about it. But I'm excited about that, so I'm going to show y'all that tomorrow. Tomorrow should be more interesting. I am hosting a workshop tomorrow. I'm going out to lunch with some friends. I'll be in the dining hall. Not for the first time, but the first time since classes started. Um, in a dining hall that I've never been to. This, so this will be my first time going there. So I'll give y'all a little dining hall review tomorrow of that with some friends. And then I might be going out tomorrow night. But don't quote me on that. Because last time I said I was going out to people, I did not go out. <laughs> But yeah, y'all just stay tuned. Tomorrow should be a more fun day of just y'all experiencing like more of the student life and not more of like the class and not the classes. Oh my gosh, it works. But because I know I usually show y'all a lot of like the actual classes and coursework and just being academic and stuff. But sometimes I don't really show y'all like the fun things that I do or going out because I'm usually enjoying my time. <laughs> But I'm gonna get better at actually picking up the camera and showing y'all that stuff as well. So y'all hold me accountable. Y'all hold me accountable to remind y'all and just show y'all all these things. But yeah, I'm gonna stop talking and I will see y'all tomorrow because it's getting late and I need to brush my teeth, wash my shower. I didn't make dinner tonight. Like I told y'all I was supposed to make dinner and it's after midnight. I need to be up so I don't have enough time to make dinner. 
just a whole lot, a whole lot. So let me get ready to go to bed and I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Okay, y'all, so I'm finally out with some friends for lunch at the niche, or niche, I don't know how you pronounce it, but the niche dining hall. It's so cute in here. This is my first time ever being in here, so it looks like you come over here and you can order like a little sandwich or something, put it all together, and they get it for you. See all the cute seating. And then, I'm guessing this is like the grill area. They like they have some really good pasta over there. And I guess you get your sandwiches from over here. Here's like the hotline where they have like regular stuff. They have some good tilapia is what it looks like. And I guess this is where you get your pizza from. You got a different pizza? No, I didn't put my name. Oh, that's tough. But this is where it looks like you get pizza and you just write your little order. It's all cute, cute. Yes, I am. Um, I don't really know what exactly this is supposed to be, but they have some cupcakes and stuff. And then over here is kind of like your little salad area sort of thing. I just got some grapes because y'all know I love me some grapes. But this salad area looks really good. Like they have different types of flavors and stuff like that. Um, and then you get like your drinks and stuff from over here. Oops, sorry. No, you're good. <laughs> yes, I am. Um... Then you get your cereal. Y'all know I love some cereal. They got cinnamon toast crunch. They got your milk, but it doesn't like they have like almond milk here. Bummer. And then you have your desserts and stuff. So today they have some oatmeal raisin, cookies, some cake, some more cookies, some soup, and then ice cream, but there's like no ice cream in here. So yeah, this is what it looks like in the niche or niche, however you call it. It does look there's like a lot of options, but I got pizza because a lot of people kept telling me that the pizza here is really good. So we're gonna try that. And I'll let y'all know how it tastes once I get the plate. And I'll show y'all everybody else eating with later too. I saw that you you said your car is a heat. Jay, Do you guys gender your cars? Yeah. And if so, what's the gender? <laughs> So I'm finally back in the room. It is after 3 a.m. Um, today has been like a lot of all over the place, and y'all just saw like a lot of clips things. So I didn't want to, I didn't want to do too too much talking. But basically today I had one class. After that, y'all know I went to lunch with some of my RA friends. After that, I came back to nap. Then I hosted my first dance workshop today, which is really fun being able to do because. This is my first time actually being able to like fully choreograph something by myself and show and teach other people. So that was pretty fun and some people came out to that. Then um, we went back to talk to some RA friends. They had a game night and then we went out. Um, there was a house party today and then there was supposed to be like another after party after that but it was dead. And then we wanted to go eat at Waffle House. Waffle House was the first one we went to you couldn't sit down in and what's the point of going to Waffle House if you got to take out and the other Waffle House was packed like basically everybody who was at the house party went there so it was just too much then they wanted to go to McDonald's and McDonald's was closed or they weren't closed McDonald's was open but the lady came out the door saying something like they not taking no more orders or whatever so basically we just ended up coming back to the room as much as I want to talk to y'all I need to go to sleep because I have a retreat in the morning at at 10 in the morning that I gotta get to. So I'm gonna do that. This is honestly the end of the vlog, but yeah, today has been pretty fun. I can definitely say 
this first week of school, these first couple of days of school has really been fun. You know, I'm talking more to people. I'm getting more outside of my comfort zone, but comfortably not outside my comfort zone to where like I'm so uncomfortable, but I'm really pushing myself to, you know, meet more people, do more things. So I'm really excited for what this school year brings. But yeah, I'll see y'all when I see y'all.